Tech Tips from Coyote Design. So one of the concerns with laminating Coyote composites is the finished edge that you get. It actually finishes better than carbon sockets I've done. In the past, those tend to stay really jagged. I used a rough cone, the roughest cone you can do. Go ahead and take that down to your trim lines. And then you can go ahead and take a medium buffing cone, which is a blue buffing cone. And you just go ahead, I start with the outside edge, kind of start rounding it off is what I'm doing. Is starting with the outside, then I go back in with that cone. And then I go outside, all the way around, go outside, or buff it, and then I go inside. So you're trying to create this smooth, round edge, not a square edge. You don't want any square edge. Square edge is gonna mean it's sharp, or make it sharp. After I've done with the medium buffing cone, I've used to take the pink Tycro wheel, and the pink Tycro wheel just do the same thing, and it just gives it a nice buffing edge. And then just bring it over to your sink with uh, some Scotch-Brite, and go ahead and wet it down, wet your Scotch-Brite down, and then go ahead and finish it off with that. This leaves a really nice smooth edge to it. There's no squareness, there's no high spots. Nothing's gonna cut me. I'm gonna press my finger as hard as I can on there. There's no sharp to it. So that's the really nice thing about doing that extra step with the uh, Scotch right here. It gives you that little bit more of a smoothness than the Tycro wheel can give you.